Most of the time, we want queues to execute in numerical order. However, if you need your queue list to go out of sequence, you can use the link command. Let's see how to use link in an example. We are going to have queue three link, which is a soft key, it says link loop, seven, which is, means queue seven, enter. And our PSD will see a couple of things here. In the link column, we'll see a seven, indicating that Q3 will link to Q7. And underneath Q3, before Q4, you'll see a link one slash seven. That refers to QList one, which is our QList that we're in, Q7. Now, if I go to Q1, enter, I'll run through these queues. If we take a look at our pending queue indicator, it shows that we are standing by for Q2, sitting in Q1. When I press go, we're gonna go into Q2. Q3 is pending. Now when we go into Q3, you'll see that now seven is pending. And when we press go, we go straight into seven, skipping over four, five, and six. Sometimes it's helpful to use a link instead of deleting a chunk of queues. For example, if a scene is cut, you may wanna link over those queues in case that scene gets put back in, it's easy to remove the link instead of trying to recreate all of those queues. To remove a link, you simply say Q3, link, enter, and we're right back where we were.